Hey family, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Asia and my nickname is Asia May. On all my channel, I create content that helps you look good, smell good, and follow Jesus. Today is a smell good video. I had an awesome privilege of going to the Creed Carmina launch event here in Dallas. And I was able to first and foremost see the beautiful displays of this new fragrance. Today we are going to not only be unboxing it, but discussing what it smells like give my first impressions and I will let you know if the juice is worth the squeeze on this one okay so first and foremost let's open her up One thing that I really love is that this came with a dust bag. I thought that was so cute. Okay, so Creed Carmina is a woman's fragrance. This fragrance retails for $445 for the 75 ml, and it retails for $300 for the 30 ml. Upon opening it, you'll get this little insert, which basically talks about Oliver Creed and how everything, every ingredient in it is natural, and it talks about the use of rare essences, and it has the website on it as well. Then there's another insert. This one one basically just gives the history of Creed and how it was founded and also how much intentionality is behind the craftsmanship. Let's talk about this packaging because that was the very first thing that captivated my eye. I was like, whoa, not only is it just a gorgeous cap, but the bottle is beautiful. I just thought this was so cute. And I actually had an outfit on at the event that matched and it was totally on accident. So I was really excited about that. Like, oh, this is meant to be. All you're gonna have is just the Creed logo on the front, the name of the fragrance, and on the bottom you'll have Made in Paris, your lot number, and then, you know, however much your fragrance is, mine says. 75 mil, 2.5 fluid ounces. Additionally, within my gift bag, I got a Creed magazine. It looks like a coffee table book. And within the middle are a bunch of images that capture the essence of the fragrance. At the event, they had these wristbands and you're able to wear them and smell the fragrance. I could still smell the fragrance and it's literally been almost two weeks now, actually. But anyways, they gave these away to us. And my first thoughts about this fragrance was that it gave me like a raspberry vibe, but I knew that it wasn't quite raspberry or something was different about this berry vibe that I was getting because of the fact that it just felt more sophisticated than like raspberries that I've experienced in the past. I also noticed when I first got it, when I, when I brought this band home and I set it on my counter and I went to sleep, when I woke up in the morning and I stepped outside of my room, this scent was like lighting up my entire downstairs. So I noticed that it has some very good ciliage, it projects, it's definitely a statement maker. That was like the second thing that I noticed. So now let's smell it because that's the most important thing and let's talk about the note. Creed describes this fragrance as a modern amber floral. So upon the first spray, I definitely get the black cherry. It's got this elegance to it. It's a deeper, more black cherry. And I'll definitely get the pink pepper as well. I also really love peonies. Like they are my favorite flower. And I can smell the rose and the peony. It is so beautiful. Like as it starts to dry down, it's really taking me along the journey of femininity. Like it feels like I'm being pampered, <laughs> which you know, might be a little dramatic, but it does. It's like a pow, like a I'm here. Then it suddenly calms down and I'm, I'm her. I'm here, I'm her, but I don't know. The, the cherry still lingers. It's really interesting. Now I wanna see what it does on my skin. I wanna see how it goes with my body chemistry. I don't think that this fragrance, you need a lot of sprays, okay? For this, I think I could get away with two, okay? Two sprays. It smells so good. The black cherry is very rich. This does not feel cheap at all. It has violet as a middle note as well as cashmere wood, but I can't, I can't smell the violet. I'm getting a lot of the black cherry. I'm getting the flowers. I'm getting both the rose and the peony. And now that it's dried down, I definitely am getting those base notes. They're just combining to create 
just a intriguing scent. It's very much so fall worthy to me. I can see this being worn throughout the year, but this is a good fall scent and I will definitely be wearing it. I can even see how you can mix and match this with other scents. It feels like a good layerable scent just to add some dimension to some of your more simpler fragrances that might have peony or rose or black cherry as more of a dominant note. I love how it mixes with my body chemistry as well, which is like why I would suggest getting a sample just so you can experience it on you. It's one thing to experience it in the store one time, but I think when you have an actual sample, you can then go about wearing it multiple days. You can just feel it for longer periods of time. Let's be real, you're spending a lot of money on these fragrances and you wanna make sure that not only is it going to fit your lifestyle, but that it's something that you can actually stand smelling for long periods of time. How do you feel when you wear it? Does the temperature change how you feel when you wear it? And typically, if you have a sample, you can try it on multiple occasions before making the decision to get such a big ticket item. I can feel how much sillage, how much oil is up in this joint, because not only does it last, but she fills the room. She makes a statement, okay? She's going to leave a breeze. When you walk past somebody, they will smell you, okay? They're gonna smell you. And it doesn't take a lot. You don't gotta spray yourself 10 times because she makes a statement <laughs> with very little effort. I'm blown away, honestly. Like, this is my first time experiencing Creed, but the way they put this together is phenomenal. Even when I smelt it initially on the wristband, I was just walking around going like this, going like, like this is something that, oh my gosh, I just can't see you getting tired of it. It's so beautiful. And I believe that a lot of you ladies are really gonna love it. So I know that there's a sample on the Creed website. So be sure to check the description box. I have links to the sample. And if you feel a bold and you're like, nah girl, I wanna get the full size bottle, I have a link to that down in the description box as well. This makes my second full-size bottle of a luxury perfume. You guys, <laughs> can we just do a hand clap? I told you guys that I was entering into my fragrance discovery journey. For those of you who are with me, I hope that this video has been encouraging and inspiring to you. Get the samples, experience the scents, and expand not only your knowledge of smells, but your experience of them too, because you deserve. So make sure you follow me for more content that helps you look good, smell good, and follow Jesus. And I will be back soon with more smell good content. Bye guys. Thank you.